Hi, my name is Samantha and welcome to today's video. Today we're gonna to be making a microwavable popcorn pouch. Let's get into it. So this is one of two pouches that I wanna make that are microwave safe. That being said, if you make anything for the microwave, everything has to be 100% cotton, your thread, your fabric, everything that you're using. So do not put anything polyester because that is plastic that will melt. It does not belong in the microwave. So. I've got some cotton fabric from my scrap bin. I need to cut it to 12 inches by 22 inches. Need two pieces. I'm gonna go ahead and cut it out, iron it, and I'll be back with you guys. 12 by 22 inches, pinned right sides together. We're gonna go ahead and sew up all four sides, leave an opening about a hand's width wide to turn it right side out. I've got my machine loaded with cotton thread cotton bobbin. I have made a, um, on my bobbin, I actually used vinyl with my Cricut to make it green. So I know that they, and I always keep them in the top left because I don't use them that often, but these are cotton, all the rest are polyester. So it's very, very important not to put polyester in the microwave. We have it sewn and turned. I need to iron it. And I realized I probably shouldn't have been using black thread. So I'm gonna to change to white thread to top stitch. White thread is loaded, ironed, and it's time to top stitch. I forgot to hit record, but we've top stitched. And look at these crazy looking black threads within it. Whatever, it's not a big deal, it's for me. So we gotta go ahead and fold two inches and then you fold the bottom to meet the top, and then you sew the sides down, box the corners, and we're done. So let me go ahead and fold an iron. I made an executive decision to do the second fold slightly smaller than the top, but I did fold the um, 
first piece down two inches and the top stitching is on the inside because that's what's going to become the outside. So stitch the two sides and then we'll go from there. to box the corners out an inch and a half, fold this inch and a half, and then sew across and that'll box the corners. Like my rat's nest. If you're wondering how I'm doing this, this is an inch, this is an inch and a half right here, so that's what I'm using as my measurement. Lovely rat's nest again. Oh, the joys of using cotton thread. Turn it right side out. Poke out these corners. I guess there's no point in top stitching. I guess I should have only top stitched the top and the, just the top, I guess. I guess the bottom didn't even need it either. I don't know. All right. Here is my super cute popcorn bag. Look at the little box corners. So you put a half a cup of kernels in here for two and a half minutes, but you keep an eye on it. Make sure it's not burning. Make sure that the popcorn's not burning. Um, I did use all cotton, so we should be all good, but better to be safe than sorry. Keep an eye on it. Don't use the popcorn button. Use two and a half minutes and use your ears to hear if the popcorn kernels are popping. But I'm excited to try it out. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Is this something you would make? Is this something you would gift? Is this something you would buy? Is this something you would try? Let me know. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for watching.